Okay, we are going to uh, repair a Roland KR370 electric piano. Uh, it has a broken hammer key. You see the uh, B-flat right there. It's uh, broke, and so we're going to repair uh, that hammer, the link. And the first thing we need to do after we disconnect the power is to move around back and uh, remove the top. And so there are three screws back there, and we'll take it loose. Okay, next we've got to go underneath the front side. And uh, there are several screws underneath. And uh, we will remove all of those so that the keyboard will come off the unit. Okay, we removed all the screws from underneath the front keyboard edge of the piano. Alright, and now we'll go up top and take the top side off. Okay, I remember, I think this top just slides right off. It just slides forward. Yeah, just like that. Do this in. And we can just pick it up off of there. No problem. Okay, once you have the top removed, uh, it's a good idea to take a vacuum cleaner and clean up the dust uh, that may have settled inside your machine and just take a moment to clean it up just a minute. So that's what we're going to do right now. Okay, now that we've cleaned up the machine, we can remove the key cover. It just lifts up and you notice it's on a little track. And uh, we will remove these corner pieces. I should just lift right out of there. Let me get this up. Yeah, it just comes out of there. All right, same thing on the other end. Okay, uh, the slide cover doesn't necessarily have to come off to change out a key. But you do have to remove this front panel uh, that has all the uh, buttons on it. So we'll take that loose by undoing the brackets at either end. Okay, now that we got the screws out of the panel, we also need to remove the one for the old uh, disk drive so that it will all come out as one piece. Notice that uh, I just set the panel on top of the instrumentation inside the keyboard box. You see the speakers? Because all I really need to get to is the keys. And uh, I'm going to lay the top back down on it, gently on it. Don't want to scratch anything. And then I want to get a screwdriver and we'll go get to the back of this key right here and remove it from the keyboard. I need to finish removing the front uh, keyboard panel. There's a screw in that corner and there's one on the other end. I need to take those out so that that front panel right here will slip off the machine so that I can get to the bottom of the key. Sure that one's out. And I think there's one right. There. Okay, this front panel should just slide right off the front of the piano, just like so. And uh, we want to lay it down so it doesn't get scratched. Okay. Okay, now we're going to remove the uh, broken B-flat key, and all we have to do is spread those gently back there, and uh, they'll come out of there, and then remove the one on either side.
see and here is the hammer that is broke you'll see right there this is a weak spot in a rolling hammer so the other part should be right down in here We'll make a repair to that with super glue, put it back together so that we can use it. Okay, I've got a paper towel, and I'm going to clean off just a little bit of the action grease that's on the uh, hammer. This is the one that's broken right here. Can you see it? I guess, yeah. And so it will glue right back up like so. And so we're going to take super glue and uh, do that piece. Let's put a little too much there. Let's put a little on and just a well, little extra goes a long way. And that is a repair to the hammer key. Okay, uh, this is a repaired hammer, and I'm going to replace it with a hammer uh, B flat, a couple of octaves up, just because this one is not as stressed, because I don't play as much on the high end. So we'll switch them out. Uh, this is not the first hammer that I broke, and I don't have a spare, but this works just as well. So they're interchangeable and they slide right back into place. Be gentle that you don't break them again. But they just slide right back in place and fall right in the slot. Just like so. This one does as well. Okay, and then you put the, the keys back in just as they came out. Front end first right in place and see my B flat is repaired and we'll do the same on this top end That's the repair to the key. And now that they're all repaired, we'll put the piano back together. Okay, the panel goes back in just like it came out. We'll put the uh, screws back in the bracket. Try not to scratch it. take a regular Phillips head and hand tighten them so I know how tight I have them. Okay, 
right, then we can reinstall the front edge, front guard. Okay, before I get the unit completely put back together, I want to power it back up and uh, make sure that I'm ready. Okay, I'll remove the power and put it back together. All right, we have uh, everything put back together. Front panels back on. Side panels are back in there. Button display is put back together. And uh, all we have left to do now is slide the top on, and we will be uh, through with changing out a broken hammer in a Roland KR370. I hope this uh, video helps. Uh, this is a way that I change out a hammer key.